granary known as El Cenebio de Valeron, which dates back to prior to the Spanish conquest, is one of Gran Canaria's most spectacular and iconic archaeological sites. The cave complex houses around 200 silos, which the ancient inhabitants of the island carved out of the rock using stone picks more than 500 years ago. These activities were used to store grain and foodstuff as well as tools and other objects. This position of the cave made into an excellent natural fortress in which to locate the seals, which were excavated into the ground and along the walls of several galleries on different levels. To view the archaeological site is necessary to climb a length high light of steps which leads to the entrance. At this point the visitor may enter several of the silos by means of the ramps provided. The caves themselves and the breathtaking ravines nearby provide the visitor with an unforgettable experience. Further information about the granary and surrounding landscape is provided on panel by means of models and reconstructions which are placed at different points around the site. The guides will also be delighted to answer any queries visitor may have. The Great Natural Arch, which houses over 350 artificially excavated caves and silos, is 30 meters wide and 25 meters high. The volcanic rock was excavated using stone and wooden tools which were the only materials available of the ancient Canarians. Many of the silos have an entrance which gives access to a circular chamber which in turn contains independent stores which appear to have been closed. The door was sealed with an ash mortar to prevent insects getting in. This mortar, which can be still seen in several silos, was also used to fill cracks and holes. Based on accounts dating back to the time of the conquest, historians today claim that communal grain stores were used to house the grain that each family had to give as a tribute or tax. Each family would have had their own supply in their house. The Stample diet of the Aboriginal population consisted mainly of barley and to a lesser extent wheat and so these were probably the products stored here. Exactly how the grain was stored is unknown. In most cases cereals were simply put straight into the silos all the remains of pottery and baskets could indicate these recipients were also used. Nowadays you can still find some animals searching for food and loving couples sitting inside the cave, yeah, <laughs> these are Damien and Tina who are sending you big hugs and kisses. Love ya! Please share and subscribe to This Is My Love. Bye bye!